down, slow down. Oh, 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 oh. Back to the channel, you guys. Welcome back to the boat gang. All right, we're going to be doing some speed run training here at the uh, park pond. All right, prepping her up for the big, the, the big body of water. So stick around. Big B, what are you going to RC? All right, we got the old UL 19. Man. Yeah, I wanted to take this thing to the speed run spot today. It was a little breezy. I just stopped by there on my way here, and it was a little breezy. I got a 16-16 on here. Running pretty good. Got a little bounce there, it looks like. Get it all worked out. I think I need a I got a flat strut position. I think I want to put a little bit of uh, negative on it. Well, oh, my CG's too far back. It looks like it's riding aft low. This is kind of a small prop. I kind of like running my boat over here. Just uh in the evening, the sun's right in my face. Kind of like it. Turn fin got bent a little bit on the way here. Testing this angle right here, see how this looks, if y'all can see the boat. And let's see how it looks over here. Let's 
see what this angle looks like. I really liked it when I was running uh, kind of over there because I could really get a, a view of the boat and you guys can too. Might be some water in here. <laughs> oh man, I've been, I was actually looking for this this morning, man. My son, <laughs> my son must have put this in my boat. I had it on the bottom shelf in my shop, in the, the shop there, and um, I always keep the hatches off, let them, you know, dry out after a run. <laughs> and my son put that in there. <laughs> Let's see the speed. Holy shit, boys! 78 mile an hour. God damn. This thing was booking, boy. That CM motor, boy. That 2080 CM right there. Woo, doggy. 109, 107, 98, 98. Woo, doggy. 78 in the park pond, son. Great googly moogly, boy. 78 in the park pond with a little with a little 1616 <laughs> but but you guys see i'm running these srd v1 packs they still got it son they still got it after a year of use they still got it in them all right running these old boys right here it's hard to get them in and out of this boat they still got it in them, son. Yes, sir. Yes. I just sir. put some negative position on my strut. Okay, you guys see the top of that line right there? Okay, it was basically in line with my bracket. You could see the back of my line. You can't see it. You see that? So I basically put like a, I don't know, maybe a tenth of a degree, 20, 20th of a degree angle, down angle on it. All right, and um probably should have just moved my batteries forward but i also moved my batteries forward okay i want to see what that does all right 78 on that last run that's crazy so i'm gonna go ahead and clear it out again Okay. So I put that little bit of negative on my strut and moved my batteries forward just a hair. Which these batteries are a little bit lighter than the other ones, but I still moved the CG forward. Looking for a good running boat so I can take it to the speed run spot. Alright, let's get it. She didn't want to stop, boy. Jeez. She didn't want to stop. Man, I probably shouldn't have moved it. I'm glad I marked that strut where I had it. I'm going to try to go like this. Maybe go diagonal into this little cove right here. See how that works. Yeah, I think I've gotten in the 70s with this boat in the past, in this pond, 74, 75. I think I was using this same damn prop. Slow down, slow down. Mm, that cover over there scares the mess out of me. 
get on it too hard, she starts dancing on me. Get it lined up here. Slow down, slow down, slow down. Woo! Not a bad position. I think I like that other position a little more. It looks like the back of my boat's picking up more though. That's good. I kind of like that so she don't blow over. Gotta go get it. <laughs> call it a day I'm gonna call it a day son yeah, I'm gonna call it a day <laughs> I am not used to running my boat over here did you guys see that y'all had to have seen it y'all had to have seen it oh hopefully everything's all right yeah she's ironclad man I built this fucker tough I check her out here make sure everything's okay it should be man I, I've really toughened this boat up yeah she's good She's good. She's good to go. My prop all right. Yep, everything's good. I got dirt. I have dirt all in my, my rudder. Actually, um, it's actually a good idea for you guys to keep a little wire paper clip uh, in, your, in your bag of tools in case you run aground. You can get that, that dirt out. Sometimes it gets packed, packed in there, you know. Damn, boy, she was running good, man. She was running good, man. She was just floating. She was just floating. And, uh, you know, everybody says to run a level, a level, a level tunnel on this boat, but I don't. I got mine jacked up in the back. Mine's jacked up in the back. All right, I'm, I'm training. This is, I'm training this boat for speed runs. <laughs> so I got her kind of jacked up about a millimeter or two, a couple millimeters in the back. You know what I'm saying? Uh, with some down angle on my strut. I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna get a hundred with this boat. I'm gonna get a hundred with this boat. That's my goal. That's my it's been my goal since I rebuilt the boat. I kind of I kind of forgot about it, but that's my goal. You better still be plugged in. 70 79 Ooh, doggy. Yes, sir, buddy. 79 knots and no freaking smoke, boy. So I went to go show you guys, take my camera off and accident like this. So uh yeah, 79 boy. Yes, sir, buddy. The only other boat faster than that in the park pond is my uh my blackjack 42. I think we nailed like 80, 80 in here on that with the 42. Yes, sir, buddy. So all the temps feel cold as shit. Like I didn't even run them. 104, 99, which I only have a 16, 16, 40 millimeter prop on here. When we prop up at the speed run spot on a pretty day, it, it ought to fly, boy. Hopefully, hopefully it don't fly, but it, it ought to fly. You know what I'm saying. We'll see you next time.